You need a financial advisor with the freedom to focus on your specific needs. Whatever your goals, Reed Potter can create a game plan tailored to you. Call Reed at 432-0777 at Pikeville, Kentucky to learn more. Recently, Big Sandy Community and Technical College awarded Amy Moore of Eastridge High School with the KCTCS High School Teacher Slash Counselor Pathfinder Award. Moore is the first ever recipient of the award and Big Sandy was more than happy to present it to her. Mountaintop News spoke with Big Sandy Provost Denise King to learn more. Oh, we are so proud of, of Ms. Moore. She's uh, an amazing person. Uh, she's actually been with uh, the high school since it was, since it was built and uh, is an incredible teacher both at the high school level and she also teaches college classes for us. Um, one of her students nominated her for this award and really talked a lot about how she goes above and beyond to help them, challenging them in their college level work and even helping them fill out their FAFSA and things like that if they don't understand. So Moore has been with Eastridge High School since it began. She looks forward to seeing both her high school and college students succeed in life. Well, it is such an honor. Um, it came as a huge surprise. Um, we were having an assembly yesterday at 1025, I think, and absolutely no one in the building seemed to know what it was for. Um, as I understand, my principal and assistant principal were the only two people who knew why. And um, so when I got down there, it was just really a shock. <laughs> and at first thought, um, when I saw it was Big Sandy, I thought maybe they were here to honor a student, maybe an early college student. Um, and I had no idea it would be me. <laughs> Um, I would just like to thank my college students. Like I said, I have no idea who nominated me, um, but they are a wonderful group of children. Um, this year has, has been the first year that I've had to split the class into two class periods because there are so many of them willing to take that risk and enter the dual credit program. And I'm just really proud of them for taking that risk and you know, wanting to step up and get themselves prepared for college before they really have to be there. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.